Building your own book hotel from recycled materials couldn't be easier. You need three empty tin cans or the bottoms cut off sturdy plastic drinks bottles, some packing tape or sellotape and scissors, or some super glue or silicon. You also need natural materials for your books to hide in, such as dead wood, tree bark, pine cones, small stones or twigs. First of all, remember that the insides and the tops of tin cans can be sharp, so be careful not to slide your hand or fingers across them. First of all, wash and dry your tin cans. Stack the tins on top of each other in a triangular shape. If you are using silicon or superglue to stick your cans together, then ask an adult to help you glue the cans together and leave them to dry. If you are using tape, stick the cans together now with tape. Now it's time to fill up your cans with your natural materials. Garden canes with small holes down the middle of them can also be cut to size to add to your book hotel. With book hotels you don't even need a garden. If you have a balcony you could tie a book hotel outside to attract insects. It helps if you have flowers growing nearby. When you put the book hotel in your garden, make sure that it's on level ground and it won't fall over or be blown by the wind. Make sure it's protected from things like flying footballs and it's surrounded by flowers. If you're growing vegetables in your garden, make sure your book hotel is kept well away from your veggie patch. If you wanted to make a bee hotel to attract solitary bees, you could instead fill all the cans with chopped up garden canes and attach a piece of string to the tins to hang it up. If you have wood at home, you may even want to ask an adult to help you make your own wooden book hotel. This is one we made for our garden. Have fun making your Bugglebee hotels and don't forget to share your photos with us.